delivering quality education, expanding access to learning, serving learners' learning needs, tackling challenges of the present time, supporting every learner's dream, reaching young Tagomenians where they are today. Advancing in the challenge of distance learning. Bringing you quality education straight to your home. Plug yourself in. This is Deb and TV. Tarana! Do you find it difficult to turn your head or neck? Can't you lift your arms all the way up? Are you having back pains? Ah. Maybe you haven't exercised for a while now. If your answer is yes, then don't let it pass. You need a massage. Learn more in today's episode of Lantau Compre with me, Teacher Zaide. Welcome to an exciting lesson you surely remember. Are you ready for my class? I cordially invite you to Wellness Massage, Quarter 2. Module 4. Apply Wellness Massage Techniques Before we start, pay attention to the following objectives. You're here today to feel good. Here's a pretest to set your mood. You have 10 seconds to answer each question. Write the letter only. Number 1. Which of the following is not a form of vibration? Letter A. Shaking. Letter B. Jostling. Letter C. Rolling or letter D rocking. Number two. All of the following massage strokes can be performed during massage of a pregnant client, except letter A Efflorage. Letter B percussion. Letter C, nerve stroke, or letter D, feathering. Number three, friction is also known as letter A, stroking, letter B, rubbing, letter C, gliding, or letter D, hacking. Number four, squeezing, grasping, and kneading are used to normalize muscle tone 
Under which stroke? Letter A. Effleurage. Letter B. Restressage. Letter C. Vibration. Or letter D. Percussion. Number 5. What is the term used in performing two or more finger press? Letter A. Hagun. Letter B. Haplos. Letter C. Pisil. Or letter D. Pindot. Thank you so much for your zealous effort answering the pretest. Such a good start! Folks, let's now uncover the five basic massage strokes. First, the florage or gliding. These and broken gliding movements are repeatedly done following the contour of the body using the palm, the knuckles, the fingertips, and the forearms. Also, it is performed with the following purposes. And rational. Ensure you reap its many benefits too. Patrissage or kneading is the cycle of rhythmic lifting, squeezing, and releasing of tissue. This is how you perform petrissage. You'll be amazed of the wonders it does to your body and well-being. Next, you have friction or otherwise known as rubbing. It is done by compressing tissues in several directions like sliding of hands, palms, fingers, and knuckles back and forth over skin or deeper tissue layers. In doing it, hands are usually dry with little or without oil. How? You'll definitely love it because of the many wonderful benefits it carries. Then, there's the potment, also termed as percussion. This massage stroke is characterized by a repetitive staccato striking movement of hands simultaneously or alternately using the following. And why is it done? Finally, you have a vibration or shaking. It is done by rapid shaking, quivering, trembling, or rocking movements applied with fingertips or full hand. Meanwhile, here's how it's done and why it is beneficial. Now, you'll witness the five basic strokes, variations, and sub-variations. A florage.
Petrasaj. Friction The Boatment Vibration I know how badly you needed a massage now after watching the videos. Before you book a schedule, here's one familiar term which is proudly Filipino, hilot. It has four main groups, namely Whether you pursue such a noble job in the future or just learn another skill, you need to equip yourself not just of the likeness but also the differences of these two important terms. Massage therapist, just like other professionals, perform various techniques to be more effective and efficient. Here's my cheat sheet for you. So you see, with constant practice and professional help, you can apply these techniques safely and effectively, even at the comforts of your own home. Do you still have the energy to answer the succeeding exercises? You sure do, as they will broaden your understanding on our topic. I am convinced our relaxing discussion reawakened your senses, making you prepared for our final task today. You have 10 seconds to choose the correct letter of the answer to each question. Game on! 1. As a massage therapist, it is important to take note of the clients during HELOT session. Letter A. 
Emotion Letter B. Reaction Letter C. Spirituality Or Letter D. Happiness The correct answer is Letter B. Reaction 2. In handling a sexually aggressive client, a massage therapist should Letter A. Address the clients politely Letter B. Talk in a strong manner Letter C. Shout at the aggressive client Or Letter D. All are correct You're right. It's a letter A. Address the client politely. 3. What should a massage therapist do when a client arrives and the room is not ready yet? Letter A. Offer a cup of tea. Letter B. Offer a magazine. Letter C. Offer a brochure. Or letter D, all are correct. Letter D, all are correct, should be your letter of choice. 4. Before a massage, one needs to eat light and easy to digest meals. Letter A, true. Letter B, false. Letter A, true is correct. 5. Drink herbal tea, if available, to hydrate and flush Toxins after a massage. A. True. B. False. You made it again. True is the answer. Thank you so much for joining me, Teacher Zaide, in today's exciting episode of Lantau Compre. Before I say adieu, here's for you. A massage is just like a movie. Really relaxing and a total escape. Except in a massage, you are the star. And you don't miss anything by falling asleep. Stay positive in life.